ഹായ് കാമ്രേഡ്സ് യുവേഴ്സ് കെ വി എസ് ദ കറണ്ട് ടോപ്പിക് അമങ് ദി സെൻട്രൽ ഗവൺമെന്റ് പെൻഷനേഴ്സ് ഈസ് നത്തിങ് ബട്ട് ദ റെസ്റ്റോറേഷൻ ഓഫ് കമ്മ്യൂട്ടേഷൻ പോർഷൻ after 10.8 years as per various judgments of the high courts and also the central administrative tribunals what is the justification to have such an demand before the government the fifth central pay commission has recommended the reduction of period for the restoration of commutation from 15 years to 12 years once you have commuted 40% of your pension the restoration of pension is being made after 15 years but the 50 pay commission itself said no it should not be it should be made as a 12 years but this has not been accepted whereas the state governments like kerala madhya pradesh odisha and punjab they have issued orders for the restoration after 12 years interest charged for various advances like house building advance he is simple interest only and not compound interest as such there is no justification to recover more what it was advanced to the retirees whatever be the commutation amount taken by the central government employees at the time of retirement a simple interest should be calculated that should be recovered after the recovery of the commuted portion amount and thereafter the interest recovery should be made as if it is being done for the house building advance the principal amount is actually fully recovered in 8.194 years if it is 8% simple interest the interest for the commutation amount can be recovered within 2.66 years the entire amount plus interest will be recovered within 10.85 years even after the full recovery the pensioners are keeping on paying for another 4.15 years actually at present the government is saying this commutation amount is not only for as a loan we are granting to it is having some insurance factor also because if somebody died naturally the amount could not be recovered from them so it some risk factor is also there and so they fix the risk factor and that risk factor is 4.15 years which is very exorbitant which cannot be accepted why because the death rate of india has witnessed a significant decline it was declined from 14.9 during 1971 to 6.0 during 2020 it is still reduced to 6.4 in rural and 5.1 in urban from the statistics who were in the age group of 60 years to 70 years have alone died the risk factor is very low at this juncture it is less than 6% as on date maybe if uh, fresh statistics is taken it will be much lesser also the life expectancy has raised to 69.7 years as per the report of the census commissioner actually our recovery will be completed on 68 years and 194 years only thereafter it is only the interest recovery only the government servants life expectancy as per the who statistics is 77 years the lic table of 1994-96 is not valid after april 2013 and new table should have been constructed but it is not done but instead the invalid table of 2013 made by the lic is being applied in the case of central government pensioners restoration of commutation after 12 years is the ideal but this has not been considered so far the department of pension and pension welfare has recommended to reduce the period from 15 years to 13 years during 2014 and again during 2023 it has sent the proposal to reduce to 12 years but the finance ministry did not accept it thereafter a parliamentary committee standing committee that also recommended in its report 110 to reduce the period to 12 years which has also been rejected the second national judicial commission appointed by the supreme court has also recommended to reduce the period to 12 years during 2021 itself the issue was discussed at length in the standing committee meeting recently on 15 12 2023 also the government took a stand 
that the stop side should wait till next pay commission and the demand is premature which was seriously protested what is the need of waiting for the 8th pay commission it was recommended by the 5th pay commission itself it has not been considered it has not recommended the recommendations of 50 pay commission so far this issue is concerned that is the concern that is our concerns actually in the meantime on 9 2024 punjab and chandigarh high court in civil writ petition number 249 and 8222 of 2024 had said the recovery of commuted value of portion beyond 128 months that is 10 years and 8 months Based on this, Ariana government by its order dated 17-7-2024 has caused orders not to recover from all the pensioners after completion of 10 years of commutation. In the Armed Forces Tribunal, New Delhi, in the case of OA 2307 of 2024, by its judgment dated 29-6-2024 has also stated the recovery of commutation amount as they have completed 12 years after the computation. Recently, the CAT Jaipur, in its OA number 413 of 2004, on 25-7-2024, held that the excess recovery of 4.4 years of committed amount should be returned and the amount of recovery of pension should be restricted to 10.8 years only. The High Court of Kerala, in red petition number 22753 of 2024, has also stayed further recovery towards commuted value of pension to the 35 petitioners of the case on 8-8-2024. In another development, the CAD Chandigarh bench in OA number 850 of 2024 has held on 29-8-2024, stayed the recovery of commuted portion beyond 10.8 months duly mentioning its order in another case under OA 746 of 2024. As such, there are several judicial pronouncements coming one after another and there is no justification at all to protract and prolong the issue and common orders must be issued by the government to restore the commuted portion after completion of 10 years and 8 months. Government should also consider the genuine demand of the pensioners and should not play with them. They are the honorable citizens and also the senior citizens who were rendered all their services at their young age for these governments. And also it is not the arm, it is their due wage that should be paid to them at the appropriate time. They should be taken care by the employer that is a model employer that is the government of India. The action taken report which was recently circulated by the DOPT for the JCM standing committee meeting for the meeting held on 29-2023 it is stated that the Department of Expenditure by its letter dated 4-6-2024 stated that the Department of Expenditure shall consider a fresh after receiving the proposal from DOP and pension welfare. Actually, they don't want to consider, but after such a pressure, now they want to consider so that they are seeking the fresh proposal from the Department of Pension and Pensioners Welfare. The Telangana High Court also in WP 26042 of 2024, recently, very recently, granted interim stay and ordered no recovery to be made from the committed portion of the pensioners. These are all the latest developments. Now, the Department of Pension and Pension Welfare has to submit a revised proposal for the restoration of committed portion. The DOP and PW should not delay further. It should be paid immediately. If the government decides to effect payment, it can be done immediately. There is no need of any formality. Otherwise, they will simply toss the file from pillar to post as if they are doing in the case of notional increment. That should not be taken place in this case. The staff side should have a vigil and he should seriously place this demand in the ensuing standing committee meeting and see that it should be settled within a time frame. This is the expectation of all the pensioners of this country. And with this, I am concluding. Thank you very much, comrade. Meet again. Uh-huh.